Hello and welcome back to Match Island Tropical Escape. This is Grim here as we take a look into the beta of this part nine, which is ooh, we're getting we're getting up there with this beta stuff. And um, yeah, it's it's been a while. Uh, don't look at when this was uploaded. <laughs> uh, yeah, uh, we're gonna pretend as if this is still in the beta phase, and we're just gonna continue on our way with the story, shall we say, for the two updates, anyways. So when we last left off, we were gonna be welcoming a new character. That character's name is Rodrigo. It looks like this, and uh, he looks like a very interesting um, kind of guy in the sense, like he looks kind of. Um, buff, I guess, like a muscle man or something like that. It'd be interesting to see what his kind of character is. Um, he kind of looks like you look at him and you kind of have a good idea what he is. But um, I digress. I'll leave. I'll let that kind of sink in for itself. But uh, anywho, I digress. Oh boy, uh, there's there's a whole lot of stuff to kind of go ahead with this, but um, we're gonna go ahead and just continue on from it and uh, do stuff from there, right? So yeah, so this will be interesting. Anyways, we shall continue off where we last left off, which happened to be. Uh, give me a sec here. It, it was actually according to this, ah, June 9th of 2021. So let's go ahead and dive in. As we left off, we were building Rodrigo's house, and as of course, we were going to be welcoming him. He's coming down the plane, as he usually, as everyone does, and uh, let's continue. This is exciting. I don't think I've welcomed anyone to the island before. Morning there. Nice to meet you. Uh, I'm Prudence. Hello, miss. My name's Rodrigo. Former bodybuilder and aspiring gardener. I, I'm sorry, hold on a second. Did you say aspiring gardener? What? Huh? Aspiring gardener? That's right. I've always wanted to do the topiaries, and I thought the land of the second chances might be the perfect place to go for it. That sounds far more interesting than bodybuilding, I have to say. Oh yeah, I thought these strong arms and smoking body could be put to a better use, don't you think? Oh god, he's one of these guys. The narcissistic Rodrigo is all in the past now. Yeah, that's what I thought. Yeah, I can see that. Anyways, uncoupled two. Have him do something, trim trees. And uh, we need to do something else, which I kind of... But yeah, this is Rodrigo. This is what he can do. We're going to be taking a look at all his animations, so don't you worry. <laughs> and uh, here's some future stuff from the future. But anyways, here's his costumes. You got a wetsuit, a stylus, and you got Chai Chi, which is interesting. But yeah, a bodybuilder turn gardener. Okay. Anyways, he's going to trim the tree now. So let's just see this. Oh, okay. Um, let, let's, let's have him do that then. Um... Okay, now he's just gonna walk slowly to his destination, which I'm, I'm surprised it's taking him this long to get to where he needs to get to. But, oh, okay, whatever, you do you, man. Uh, oh, okay, yeah, so this is the animation, and um, as you can see, um, it still needs some work, unfortunately. So um, let me just go ahead and try to get a good look at this. Um, all right, let's zoom in here. I guess this is as good as we're gonna get. I get the idea what's going on here, by the way, but... Um, yeah, it didn't work out the way it did. But anyways, yeah, he's going to trim the trees and give us a branch, which is going to be needed. All right, we need this, the flower arch way, which is going to be interesting. I figured we're going to put it next to Rodrigo's house because, you know, why not? Let's make his place look like he, he's been gardening. But yeah, weird. I guess it makes sense because he has a little gardening in the front of his house. But still, it's like, really? Gardening? Mm, what makes you wonder why he he decided to leave the place in the first place, right? There's there's got to be something else to him. I don't know what it is, but the guy, you know, it's like everybody who moves in here, it's just like, oh, I'm doing this for something else. It's like, okay, what was your story? Why did you move out? It makes you wonder. It makes you wonder indeed. Like like for example, there's like Andy there. <laughs> I don't know what their story is, but. Oh, whatever. Probably in the future we might know more about them. But anyways, we did that, so now we just have to wait for him to do his thing, which he finally done. Hooray. Oh, wow. It's beautiful, isn't it? Thanks for the help, Grim. Um, are you about to cry? 
What? No? It's just humbling, isn't it? Seeing nature transform through your very own hands? I guess. It does look good, I must say. Oh my god, he's a big baby? I, I, I didn't- oh, ooh. Do you enjoy the smell of grass and flowers? Um, I actually do like making pot puree. Maybe one day you could make some for me, and I could fashion something for your garden. Yeah, I like that. So he's a uh, okay. Place greenhouse and get her to do a pom beret. So get, get, let me get this straight. So he is a bodybuilder who also likes gardening, and he's very sensitive to his emotions. Ooh, okay. <laughs> what, 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 what kind of guy is this? And uh, if if I'm not, it might it might just be me. But uh, me, me thinks that there's some sort of chemistry going on there, like Prudence is talking to Rodrigo, and for some reason, it, it, I don't know what it is, but it seems like... Wait, wait, wait hold, 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 hold on a second. Are, are you saying that Rodrigo and her is going to go f do a thing? Huh. I don't know how to feel about that. I mean, we have another problem on our hands with Amy and, uh, you know, Skadoosh. But... <sighs> <laughs> I still love the fact that I, that's his name now. I call him that. Oh boy. Anyways, oh oh good. This this is another animation he does, which I post and tease at some point. But yeah, this is what he does. He just kisses muscles. Oh yeah, he's so big and strong. <laughs> These animations, man. Like jeez, jeez, and malice. Oh boy, you're spicy meat to my ah. But uh, yeah. Yeah, he's gonna do that for four hours. <laughs> no, I, I agree. I'm, I'm, I, I, man, God. All right, let's see the other one. Oh, Chai Chi, that's not bad. Yeah, he's gonna do his little. Yeah, that's not bad. You know, I guess it would fit with his costume. I would think having a Chai Chi kind of do this, it, w it would make sense, right? But yeah, and yeah, and th that's the other thing too. He also does Tai Chi. So okay, this guy. Man, Sometimes these characters get added into this game. Makes you wonder, what the what what is their story? Because, oh boy, my God. Some sometimes they just kind of go, oh boy, a, a lot. But yeah, anyways, we're gonna be doing that while we wait for the building to be done. And let's open up a free box. Oh boy, we're getting sunbathed, um, Sama. That's that's always what I want to remember. Kind of reminds me of oh I got to give and surf, but you know we're gonna hold off on that just for now because we got this done. Hooray! It's not much, but it does remind me of home. I used to have a potpourri bowl on my table at all times. It brought the smell of Hyde Park into my home. Are you from London? Yes. Wow. I haven't thought about home in a long time. Gotta love those characters talking to one another like weird, um... Oh, don't get homesick on me now. You're gonna make me cry. Oh no, not again. No, wait, don't... Do it! Here comes the fireworks! I just... <laughs> wish there was something I could do to make your home come closer to you. That's okay. Just take the pot per bowl. I'll be fine. No, let me just do something to bring Hyde Park to Match Island. Oh my god, he's such a big baby! <laughs> Alright, do us get him the papare balls, I guess, and build a squirrel. Okay, why? Why build a torpere squirrel? Is, is this something she likes? Why a squirrel, though? Okay, whatever, dude. You, you do you, I guess. You can build in front of your house, why not? Oh boy. This this is gonna be something, isn't it? But um, oh God, God. <laughs> Part of me wonders if he actually is that sensitive, and he cries like a big baby every everything he gets. Like he's so attached, like he's so sensitive, or or maybe just maybe he's kind of manipulative. I don't know. I, I still don't know. He's again. I have to be cautious about these guys because God. It, it, who knows? They, they, they call me back for second chances. He did something in, in, wherever he came from. So it makes you wonder, what did he do? Why why is he moving here? Hmm. 
questions and answers that may never get answered, or maybe it will. Who knows? This this is this is certainly the um, the drama that comes with Match Island, I must say. And you know, I'm clicking on Pixie, but I'm trying to click on <sighs> you know who? No, not you. For God's sakes. I mean, yeah, it's nice. They're gonna have you do this, I guess. Which is you playing hopscotch? Okay. Well, this this should be interesting. And uh okay, well, wow, okay, wow. Do you need to do that much? Alright, fine. Look at that stuff. And oh, okay Alright, let's do this. Yeah? Yeah, that's that's how you do it. Yeah. Gotta throw him to him. Put it there. And then he's gonna Yep. Yeah, there you go. Wow, look at that. And then they're gonna go over here and it disappears. And then they're gonna reset and do that for about, what, how many, how long is this gonna be? For nine hours or so? It's a long time, but, uh, yeah, let's just see this again, because I'm just fixated. You know, sometimes the animations are actually kind of interesting, I'll give it that. Like, it's actually kind of cool, the kind of ideas they come up with and the items they drop. And then other times, it's like, what, what were you thinking? <laughs> And, of course, this is still in its beta, so it, sometimes it's a little wonky, and who knows if this is going to be limited to, like, um, level system, or if, if, if it's going to be like, oh, you need a costume in order to do this, because I have a feeling for some of these, it's, like, costume limited, like the Tai Chi one, I have a feeling. I would not be surprised if that's the case. But, yeah, anyways, uh, yeah, cut there, get a gold. Oh, good, we got another one of his suits, which we don't need, because, we, you know, we got gold already. Do it again. And, uh, got a zookeeper, so that's nice. Again, stuff that we need. Another cut, again, just to see the characters that we need. And, uh, he's gonna be doing fishing, which is another animation that's new for this update, or this level. So, anyways, this is what he does. Yeah, I guess that that's fishing, alright. Oh, he got himself a fish! And he's gonna put it back. And he's gonna fish it out again. So, that tells me either one or two things. Either that is a toy fish that he's playing around with, which, you know, would be more ethical for his standard. Or, the fish is being too stupid that it keeps on going to the same thing over and over again. And I'm gonna say it's the same fish because, you know, it's, it's, it's a recycled animation. What do you expect? God. Okay, so another cut here. And this is basically me finally doing the, the thing with Rigo, as you can tell, which is this here. Which is him doing the surfing, which I guess... Oh, okay. Yeah. Alright, cool. Yep. Yep, that's... Oh, God. Okay, so you're posing with it now. Nice. I guess let's zoom in on this then. And, uh, you know, I have a feeling that this isn't complete fully because, you know, it's like you should pick out... I, I don't know how they're going to do this, but yeah, okay. Also, um, I love the fact that uh, Prudence is just chilling out there, just relaxing as she would do. But anyways, yeah, that's that's his animation there. So that's all his animations we got so far, so that's not too bad. Right, so it's going to be a little while before the temporary squirrel gets done, and then from there we'll find out what we can do next. And uh, yeah, he, he loves posing, doesn't he? Oh god, he is full of himself, isn't he? But I guess it's to compensate for something else. Uh, Torpiary Squirrel? Have you ever been to Hyde Park? Um, no. I just thought that's something you might have seen there. Well, there are squirrels. And bushes. So let's just say this is a free version of what you might find in Hyde Park. But look at the time. We should get to work. Amy must be waiting for you, Grim. Wow, okay, dude. So, squirrels in the park. God, you could just limit it to everybody. Every park has a squirrel. Outside has squirrels. God. Grim! God! Bob and I were just thinking about new recipes for juice. Actually, I was just wondering about taste. Gosh, what are you talking about now, Bob? Yeah, I was just saying how taste is like colors in your mouth. My favorite color is green. Bob, how much have you been smoking today? Like, what were you eating? So that would mean that green fruit should be my favorite, right? If only there was green fruit.
What are you talking about? There's a lot of green fruit. There's grapes. There's apples. There's... Oh, right. We got pears. Oh, why am I not surprised? There's gotta be pears. I mean, what other green fruits do we got in Match Island right now? Nothing but pears. Oh, the fruits that's done by you-know-who that I don't want to... He shall... Who shall not be named. Because... Again, we're just gonna be... No, just reasons. Just whatever. We're, we're done. We collect all the four of them. Whoa! Grim! You did it again! Yeah, yeah. Green fruit. Hooray! Man, Amy, why are you such a sourpuss? Can we get back to work? We have things to do. Although, now that you guys mention it, we're not offering parrot juice. That might be interesting. Yeah, give Bob credit. He did good. Yeah, that's why you have him on the team, right? Right? Hi there, sweetie. Oh, hello, Kadoosh. What are you doing here? Oh, hey, Cav. That doesn't sound like a proper greeting to your boyfriend, does it? Wow. What a dick. I'm sorry, Cav. I'm just working. Oh, I just thought you could take a break and do something better. Like, being with me. No, no, I think we're good. I think Amy could uh, still continue working. But that, that makes me ask, why? Uh-huh, yeah, just hold on, we're in the middle of something. Aw, oh, Skadoosh is not happy about that. <laughs> By the way, I still love it calling him Skadoosh. He's a real Richard sometimes. Anyways, get uh, two juice stuff and uh, deliver it. Weren't we making pear juice before, though? Like, yeah, it's like one of the first things we get, so... Okay, what? Alright, fine. This is when we finally get to introduce to it, I guess. I don't remember anymore. <laughs> it's been so long. Uh, okay, well, alright. Mm. Alright, so I guess we're waiting for that, so it wouldn't be too long. But yeah, we're done, so let's continue with the story. Yeah! The pear juice is a success! Here, try some, Gaff. Or I could try something tastier, like kissing my girlfriend. Oh my god, calm down, you horn dog. Gav, stop. I'm working. This makes me this will make me sick. <clears throat> Alright. I might as well get used to this, don't I? Hey, what's that supposed to mean? Uh-oh. Little trouble in paradise? Let's hope so. You're always working. You never hang around with me anymore. Everything's always about work. Wow, what a dick. <laughs> um, I feel like I shouldn't be a part of this conversation. Oh yeah, Bob, you're here. I couldn't have seen you behind the trees there. But yeah, no, this is awkward. Yeah, dude, you feel well because you aren't. Cool, we're on the same page then. God damn it, Bob. Bob, why don't you deliver some pear juice to the mayor and then take the afternoon off? Oh, right! Free weekend! <laughs> uh, I mean, I only imagine that's what he's thinking. Anyways, the uncoupled... Man, mmm, you know, the story's called Uncoupled. Makes me wonder if what is going on here is it's gonna be my fantasy. Is it really gonna be happening? Mm, maybe. But, uh, yeah, he's gonna go fishing again because that's part of requirement, and then I also had to deliver something, which I did, so that's great. But, yeah, uh, trouble in paradise. Fingers crossed, let's hope so. Nine hours, by the way, doing this. Why? Why do you have to fish for five, nine hours? <laughs> you, don't, you don't need to fish for nine hours. That's too long, man. But okay, whatever. Oh yeah, and um, th this happened. I don't know. No, well, this, this is a new thing, I guess. Which is, I guess, weird bubbles oh wait no now i remember they changed the bubbles that's what it was so it used to be like a, i guess pinky like slime or jelly or something like that but they changed it to like the bubbles now i guess because it's easier to see i'm guessing that's what it was i mean i don't know these they i guess they went with something they didn't like it so they were like nah you know what nah screw it we're changing it again I mean, why do you care, though? Because I stopped caring about the Smash stuff. <laughs> I feel so bad. This game's called Match Island because it's best, best three puzzles, and yet here I am being like, I don't want the puzzles. <laughs> Anyways, I got it done, and uh, yay, look, 129's finished, and I got this weird... 
station thing for horses. You know. Oh, and by the way, the gardening pack is finally here. That's I get, I get cool. I don't need it though. I guess you know. Wait, hold on. Hasn't it always been there? I guess it has. I don't know. It's been so long since I did the recording of them last nine one. So whatever. He's done. Now that we got rid of him, why don't we? Look, Gav, I know I've been busy, but this job's very important to me. I just need to focus, you know? Yeah, if he was a true boyfriend, he would let you do your job. Come on, Amy. It's just a job. <laughs> what did you say? Do you even listen to me when I speak? It's not just a job. It's much more than that. It's me doing something for the first time. Yeah. Juice. This guy being thick on purpose, Grim? No! No, he hasn't. He's been like this since the very beginning. This is the first time you're opening your eyes. The front, well, everyone in the, this island has been seeing since day one. I think you better just leave, Gav. Oh. Oh, is this what I think it is? What? You're rejecting me? I'm not rejecting you. I just need some time. Wow, she's rejecting him. Fine, you go ahead and do that, alright? But don't come begging for attention later. Yeah, I don't think that's gonna happen. Ooh, burn! Ooh, Chad Amy! <laughs> Going after the virgin skadoosh. <laughs> but, uh, that's, I wouldn't either here or there, but, uh... Oh, are they breaking up? Are they breaking up? Oh, boy! <laughs> oh, I hope so. Mmm, I hated the pairing since I first saw him, and I'm glad it's finally happening. Maybe. I don't know yet. Um, I guess we'll just have to wait and see, but, um... Anyways, uh, I guess after that stuff, let's go ahead and continue. So, that means you guys are broken up? Yes, finally! Yay! Not sure what it means, actually. I just left him there and came to deliver your orange juice. Alright. If it means anything, I think you were right. I think he's never really got you. I mean, he's a magician, for crying out loud. Doesn't he know anything about real work? Oh, Amy's being a little sassy over there with her tongue sticking out. I guess she's agreeing with pru Prudence. But that's good on her. Finally, finally she's seeing the light. Thank God. It's been so long. Why didn't it take us so long to kind of let this happen to her? I, I don't know. Finally, she it's done. Hey there again. Oh, hey, Rodrigo. This is Amy. Ames, this is a new neighbor. He's an amazing gardener. Hi, nice to meet you. Likewise. Hey, I have something I'd like to show you over at the forest. Would you care to join me? Oh, he's hitting on Prudence. Ah, uh, I knew it. Place tape into a gazebo. Okay, God. Oh, God, he's gonna go after her. You know, we, we finally have Amy now longer with Skadoosh, and now... Prudence is going to go with Rodrigo, so we got that going on now. I guess I have to make some room in the picnic area, I guess, just to, you know, stuff. But, oh my god, this this episode, man. <laughs> we went from one end love crying stuff to go into another love thing. Oh dear. By the way, uh, did you just also notice that Prudence and uh, Rodrigo were talking at the same time? So, the first time I see something like that happening. So, you know, it's interesting with the whole mechanic of them actually doing animations and talking like that. It's an interesting mechanic, I'll have to say. But something tells me that's going to have a build time, isn't it? Yeah, I knew it. Of course it does. Uh, two hours, so I guess that's not too bad. Could be worse. But, you know, I'm not happy about it. <laughs> of course I'm not. I want to continue with the story, but I can't. Because they're so close to unlocking the sawmill station. So close. Just one more, and then we'll get there. Which is about right now. Oh, uh, what is this? I just thought you enjoyed having some dinner with me. Oh, he's, he's already smooth talking. Look, he got the lights and everything. Man, this guy is just smooth. Um... I'm still kind of nervous, though, what he really is on the real side, because I'm just kind of like, uh, I don't hope it's not a skadoosh all over again. Oh, wow. Uh, this is real nice, Rodrigo. Thank you. Uh-oh. But I don't think I'm interested in you in that way. Oh, no. Rodrigo got rejected. <laughs> no! Uh-huh. I must have picked up the wrong vibes back there. 
I'm sorry about that. That's alright. We can still have dinner, though. There's nothing wrong with having dinner with friends, is there? Oh no, you got friend zoned? Oh, that's even worse. <laughs> uh, no! Oh, if no one's happy with love. And by the way, you unlocked the sawmill. Finding at the sawmill station. It's what it's called. And uh, we're going to take a look into this. And then, you know what? We're probably going to go for a break. Yeah, first time we're going to be doing breaks. But, uh, you know, I, I have the finance now to do it. Hey, Grim. You know, I've been thinking about what Prudence said. And I kind of feel like I need to take care of myself before I start a relationship. Wow, this came out of nowhere. For one minute, it was like, oh, I need a boyfriend. Now it's like, nah, I don't need any more. You just don't stay at one position, do you? Now that I've figured out what I want, I just think I should focus on that. But then I think about my mom, who was always pushing me forced on to work like she did. And I really don't want to wind up like she did. Now I'm curious about your mom. Something tells me we're going to see your mom at one point. I, I just don't know why. And who is this for? Hey, it's Andy, our mail person. Janet Smith. The address is written on the back. Ah, uh, her mother, Janet. I have a feeling we might get to know a bit more of her in the future. Let's hope. Huh. Is this for your mother? Yeah, I've been putting it off, but I need to answer her letter. I just hope her answer helps me in some way. Man, they're building up her mom so much. It's She's gotta be in the game at some point. Morning there, neighbor. We haven't had much of a chance to talk lately, haven't we? It's been real busy for us. Tending to the goats is no piece of cake, I have to tell you. Yeah, it's been like a goat story. I mean ghost story! Anyways, we need to collect some wood to make new racks, and we wanted to take a chance to explore a new part of the island. Oh, so that's why you're talking to me. Open up the land, Grim. Chop chop! Wanna come with? I guess I have no choice. Collect sticks and uh, get the sawmill station. Oh boy, guess who gets to do that? That's right, Rodrigo. Guess what you're doing for the next whatever minutes. Yeah, you're gonna be slowly inching your way over here and you're gonna be doing this for two day two two times because you're unfortunately the only guy who could do it because everyone else, they need a costume in order to do it. So uh, I'm, I'm all out of luck. But finally, we get to unlock the station, which we're gonna do right now. And just as we do that, we're also going for a break. So, I'll see you in a bit. See you, bye bye Welcome back. We just finally opened up this thing, and now we have the sawmill station, and oh boy, wooden crate. Something tells me I have to build that, so I should probably hold off on that just for yet. But yeah, now we got this land updated, so we should probably build a road, I guess, to connect the, um, the land there, because it's kind of empty. We want to have people kind of walk in there, right? But anyways, we can still have him do this for two more times, sadly, but uh, it's what it is, unfortunately. But yeah, anyways, he's done with that, finally. Hooray. Hey, Grim, do you know the sawmill station was here? Yeah, I kind of knew now. There's so much we still don't know about the island, right? Yeah, it does make you lumber. Oh, God, the puns. Man, I'm missing you already, Curly. Come back to me! Yes, but all will be revealed eventually. The island will tell all. Do you think this thing still works? Nah, it looks like it's all bark and no bite. Get it, Grim? Bark, because it's cutting wood and, and the wood has bark. Get it? Yeah, no, I got it. Believe me, I've, I've dealt with a lot of punny men in my time. Lots of punny men. I think Grim gets it, Jim. Don't ask silly questions. Um... Wait, isn't Jake supposed to be talking? Why is Jim talking to himself? Okay, this is this is weird. Gosh, we're on fire today! Hey, why don't we give this thing a go and see if it still works? What is with Pixel and puns? Like, really? This is like dad jokes all over. Like, any, any game I, I cover. It, it, goosebumps? Atoms? This game. Puns! And every time there has to be someone who does puns. Like, oh, oh, why make me suffer? Why make me say it? <laughs> oh boy, this is going to be an interesting one, isn't it, folks? I mm, think so. Anyways, we're about done with this. Good to finish this off. Uh, we just gotta deliver it to Amy, so let's do that now. Wow, 
guys, I want to create. This could be real good for the business. We can sell juice by the crate. We thought you liked the news. You should check out the place, Amy. It's a Lamborghini of sawmills. It's true. I saw it. Huh. That's some gentle comedy. Oh, believe me. It was much worse when you're with him, Amy. Oh, believe me. Yeah, indeed. I did it true. God. God! Mm -hmm. If we're going to start expanding our business, we're going to need up our game. We need to start producing more fruit, guys. Uh-huh. So we're going to need plant more trees, right? Did somebody say gardening day? Woohoo! He's doing his best Homer Simpson impression. Wow. I've never seen someone get so excited about gardening. Yeah, me neither. I mean, I guess he, maybe Rodrigo might do that. But anyways, place the gardening shop, place two trees, and two palm trees. So there you go. Yeah, so this is a shop for Rodrigo right here. Why not? But yeah, I, I mean, I'm not surprised Bob is also the one who kind of does it. He kind of looks like a vegan shaggy <laughs> from Scooby-Doo. I'm, I, I don't know if I've made that joke already, but, you know, I've, I've been hinting at it. Come on, we all know he's a hippie-ish kind of guy. You know what I mean, the vegan type. You know that kind of type we're talking about, right? That's the type he is. It's obvious. But you know what he kind of comes across as? He kind of comes across as that kid who's, like, rich, actually, but he doesn't want to show that he's rich. And he's like, I'd rather be laid back and look like a bum. It, 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 I don't know why, but it kind of makes me think that's the case, but... I have no idea. I don't think it's the case, but it'd be funny if that, you know what I mean? Yeah? Yeah, I think you do. Okay. Right. So then. Um. Yeah, right, you need to put this down. So we should probably do that and uh, find some space. I guess, yeah, here is good enough, I guess. Yeah, so let's do that. Mmm, nice. Six hours. That's fantastic. Oh well. It's not like you care. I mean, it's gonna be quick anyways, but man, it just, it just takes too long sometimes. But I put more pears because, yeah, we need more pear trees because that's what we need to do. Right. Good. Oh, I could put that there. All right. But yeah, okay. Um, anyways, <laughs> I'm happy. Yeah, I'm happy that uh, Amy's now free. Good. Good. She deserves it. <laughs> Put a, put put pears and the bananas, banana trees. I already made a joke about bananas, uh, two actually, but I probably should be more like, you know, potassium. But um, whatever. Anywho, let's just keep on doing this because why not? Yeah, I just hear a bunch of giggles because I need the money. Cause how much? Oh god, it stopped, so I don't got no more. Mm, sucks to me, me. Anyways, oh yeah, he has the new thing about making spaghettis. Making the spaghetti! Alright, where is he gone? He's gone over up here, isn't it? Why did he not show me? Okay, well, anyways, this is him making a spaghetti. And, uh, why is he making spaghetti? I don't know. Why Why do you ask? He Just what he does. He's, he's the guy who makes spaghetti. He looks like the guy who makes spaghetti. Doesn't doesn't, doesn't it look like he makes the spaghetti? Okay. <laughs> I don't know anymore. Just... To... Sure. Why not? Why not? <laughs> he makes the spaghetti. I maybe in the story we'll find out why he makes the spaghetti, but um Oh well. Whatever. Anyways. Yeah, we got that done. And uh we still need to do some more because I still had to raise money and I finally got it done. Took a little while too, by the way. Um God, I forgot to see what time it was when this was taking place. It's still in June, mind you, but I just meant like how long ago has this been? Because it like to keep you guys updated with that type of stuff. But, you know, oh God, a day? The planet tree, I mean, I guess it's fast compared to real life. But still, like, look at this. This is done. Why can't the, the thing be done? I'm going to have to hold off on that because if I do that, you know, you know, I wait. Yeah. Because I know what will happen if I don't, right? Because the thing will then activate and then things will glitch out and I don't want to do that. So, you know what? Now let's activate it, finally. Trees ready? Yeah, it's been bananas. Oh no, Bob, don't you start. Yeah, you already made that joke the last time you planted the banana tree. What joke? 
Oh god, Bob, no, please, no, not you too. Now, let's get the juice flowing here, shall we? We need to start promoting new recipes and offering wholesale to our clients. We've got bananas, we've got oranges, apples, pears. Pears. The one cat brought for me. Oh no, don't you start going to reconsider. What? Oh, uh, never mind. Let's get the ball rolling, guys. Yeah, that's right. You get distracted and not do that. It's a pear juice and get the banana orange mixed juice thing. Blend. Yeah, that's what it is. My bad. But, um, yeah. Yeah, you don't think about him, Amy. He's nothing. He's nothing to you no more. He's gone. He doesn't exist. <laughs> Makes my life easier. But, um, you know. Oh, boy. <laughs> oh, boy. Oh, oh boy. <laughs> <laughs> oh no. Oh god. Why? 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 Why do this to me? You know, but whatever. Whatever, man. It's whatever. We'll be making these juices, and again, I don't know what day it's supposed to be. I guess I'll find out eventually. After this, maybe. Pear juice? Check. Banana and orange blend? Check. Hello there, young man! What's this I see? You've been making new recipes! Yes, we're offering wholesale now that we have crates from the sawmill. The sawmill? You've been using the sawmill without proper preparations? That could be a fire hazard! Did you say fire? Oh no, now you're getting him worked up. And of course, Pixie has to come in and butt in on the joke. Why does he always have to come in and ruin everything, right? We just wanted to make some, find a sawmill, and then he, he's freaking out now. Why? I need to talk to Amy right away! I think she left to make some deliveries. Well, what should we do about the fire? There's no fire yet, young man. Relax, but do refrain from using the sawmill station until we've gotten everything ready. Grim. Would you help me track Amy's deliveries down and find her? Do I really have a choice? Anyways, I gotta do the delivery stuff. And, uh, yeah, now it's the 16th of June, so now I know. Now we know what time it is, so it gives you a context of how long this has been going on, so not too bad. By the way, I believe that we're almost getting close to finishing the betas, because as soon we're going to get into the actual release of it, and I'll know exactly when that will be. Oh, I'm sad face because, you know, he wants wood sticks, but he can't do that because I need to do it right now for him. So, great. I had to jump cut that to have him do that so he can get the wood, um, the stick that he requested for. So, you know, he can he can ask. I love when games do that, by the way. Go, oh, can I get this thing that only I can make? Can you do that for me? Thank you so much. Mm. Mrs. Smith, thank goodness I found you. Pixie, I'm finishing a delivery here. Oh, hello, Lorigo. I'm afraid this can't wait, miss. It's about the sawmill station. It cannot be used unless we have a fire station. Oh, good. Now we need a fireman. Or woman. Or person. Can't use a sawmill station without a fire station. That should be simple enough, right? We've just built one. Oh, we need a fireman! Or woman, or person, Pixie. A fireman, huh? A strong, brave person who can fight fires? Oh no, don't tell me you're gonna offer your position. Well, look no further, people. The obvious choice is here. They're both dumbfounded by the idea that Rodrigo would be the one who was doing it. Okay, why not? Makes my life easy. And not only that, but it also makes sense because he doesn't really have much of a job right now. So yeah, he can kiss his muscles and get the fireplace built. And uh, yeah, spoiler alert, that was the last point of the quests we got to talk about because after this, we're going to end it pretty soon. But yeah, he's going to keep on kissing his muscles and uh, we're going to need to put the fire station down and... Uh, <laughs> oh, speaking of that fire station, something bad happens to it. I, I won't spoil it, but let's just say next video, um, you're going to see the end result of it, and, uh, oh, oh, oh boy. <laughs> There's so much, so much to talk about with that, but, um, I'll hold it off for now. Not yet. Not yet, Super. Not yet. I'm hyping it up, you see, because why not? Right, okay. 
now then, with that in mind, we're pretty much finished with this story. Uh, because at some point, I get an update that introduced one last thing to get into the game before the game becomes live. And from there, you'll see the change that happens in the game. As You know what I mean? Like, you'll actually see the last little thing they want to add to the game before it becomes officially there. Oh, great. Good. I, I forgot. I don't have the money. Because, <coughs> of course, I don't. Gotta sell some stuff to people. The people that what they want. If you want apples? Can't get it yourself? Right, I'll get by it to you. Oh, Pixie, you want your poetry book? You want me to sell that to you again? Okay, sure. Why not? Hmm. Yeah, why? Why not? Give me the monies. Because this is the only way I can do it. That or have p characters do quests. But the quests suck. Really, they do. They take too long and they don't drop a whole lot. It's not like other games because you know, still got so much money. All right. So it's the next day. He's going to keep on kissing his muscles, I guess. Oh, no, he's going to do the chopping of the wood because I need the money for it. Which, by the way, I have enough. So now let's put the... Oh, God. Okay. I forgot about the black border. Uh, let's... Uh, yeah, that. Mm. Okay, let's not... Let's not think about that real quick. Um, all right. Also, uh, there is one thing that does happen at some point. Uh, the, a new feature got added to this game. And um, I'm going to read to you what it is because this popped up out of nowhere and... Um, yeah, I don't know why. Uh, I'm not supposed to have this just yet, um, but it, it appeared for some reason. And uh, what that thing is? Well, that. This thing. What is this? Check the Harper's request every 12 hours. Explore specific items in a row. Import random expansional materials. By the way, that 12 hours is a lie. But I digress. You'll see what I mean in a minute. But oh yeah, look, it's, it's glitched out. And you might be wondering what's going on here. Well, the update hit, and uh, the game is kind of in this limbo period of not doing anything. Because I basically have to force stop here. Because the next video is going to be introducing... So we're not going to be looking to new characters or finishing a quest. I mean, we are kind of per se, but not really. Because what we're actually going to be doing here is we're actually going to be having new quests that got added. From some characters that got introduced but yet passed. And we also got a new scene, a cinema interesting but yeah we got some new items that got introduced as well to kind of give us a hint of what to expect moving forward but yes that's it for part nine to the beta testing facilities and oh yeah we got this by the way elvis's tower we're gonna find out more about that in a minute because uh here's another spoiler elvis gets some dialogue too kinda You'll see what I mean in a minute, but yeah, we're going to get a little bit more lore with the story as far as the characters who didn't really have much quest goes. We're going to get more fleshed out. So upon part 10, we're going to go into the characters that were introduced and yet weren't really featured as much as they should have been, and you'll see why. So, until then, I've been Grim, and I'll be seeing you next time for more Match Island Beta Madness. So, until then, uh, yeah, I, I don't know how to end this properly because, uh, I mean... Oh God, let's not cry like Rodrigo. Oh God, excuse me. <laughs>